Man, prayers out to Rod 49, man, in stable condition. Got hit up down there in Miami. Was them bullets meant for you? Or you the victim? You got hit up in a crossfire. And we finna get straight into it. Nigga, just out there, you know, you doing your thing. Music video. But she, you know, there's other niggas that want to come to the music video and show off. So they come, you know, look hard to yell. Rolex. Could be plain Jane. Nigga, keep it everything. You have people that everything. Yeah, nigga, design our own. Niggas in the, yeah, they in the cut looking. You know what I'm saying? Behind the scenes, they, they, uh, they looking. Nigga sizing niggas up on the sideline and mean mugging it. You know, trying to see if you got a gun and, you know, niggas wearing tight jeans and or fit clothes so you got a gun on them. You know, they did have the homework, but they ain't know that buddy got his partner right there. He just in the cut. He over there talking to old girl or he over there get something to eat or whatever. You know what I'm saying? He went to the bathroom. He didn't even know it. He ain't even know it. And he strapped. You know what I'm saying? He strapped. Oh, he just got my back. He gonna run up. He just got my back. He ain't finna leave me. He ain't finna. Nah, he ain't going down like that. But you, you know, you cocky. You ain't about, you ain't even worried about none of that. Cause she, you, you got a switch. You know what I'm saying? Even if a nigga got that fire, nigga see that switch. If that switch go off, you ain't gonna get right. Nigga gonna get down. The sign gonna make niggas get down. But they strap. You know what I'm saying? So, but, you know, you swung it. You swung it. I don't know if Buddy Buck or Buddy, his partner came around and you had to hit him. And his partner was reaching. So you had to go ahead and yeah, let that thing go. And she, he was in the way. Everybody was in the way. So I could just, I ain't got time to, you know, it just one of me. I ain't really got no time trying to just spot you out. Trying to aim and make sure, nah, I got a switch. I'm finna slam the thing. Security coming. Police may be coming. I'm hearing shit over here. Niggas talking over there. And then, oh, nigga, everybody get down. And you hear 10 people. 10 people got hit. So he, he just spraying like, get back. Yeah, I'm coming off the scene with this. Yeah, just watch or whatever. It could have came from Buddy they were robbing. Yeah, he had his partner. He was in the cut. And his partner seen some commotion going on. He like, yeah, he just came up and started blasting. And she hear everybody like, nigga, we got to go. Yeah, we got to go. He ain't know what's going on. You know what I'm saying? He just started fine. Could have been that. But, you know, uh, ain't no telling but the shit happened. <laughs> it happened and 10 people they hit. Well, it could have been a situation now for long. But Rod 49 people, they hit something. Yeah, them niggas from New Orleans shit. They, hit, they see something sweet. And the dudes that they robbed, they found their location. Somehow, I don't know. Uh, social media, uh, Instagram, Facebook. You know what I'm saying? They don't, they're going to shoot the video. They find their location. They seen a little sweet lick. And them niggas followed them somewhere and yeah. Then they go right there and got down. It could have been that. So you never know. A nigga feel like he ran with that switch. Come on now. Now imagine he a young nigga and he got an itch. Yeah, he got an itch and he got a switch. He ain't got no money, but he got an itch. He got a habit. He got that switch. Yeah, you gotta get it. Yeah, he gonna get it. Young nigga, Baltimore. Young nigga, New Orleans. Baton Rouge, young nigga, yeah. And he still have a hold though. You know what I'm saying? He still, yeah. He still, you know, he living like that. And he driving scats and all that stuff. But, you know, he he live, you know, play to play. Jew to jew. Uh, uh, robbery to robbery. You know what I'm saying? Like, look, hit to hit. Yeah, he ain't, you know. But he got the scat though, but that's stolen. But he got the shit switched up. You know what I'm saying? But he, whoever did that, he sent back like, damn, I hit 10 motherfuckers. Uh, I can't get caught up with that. It's 10 people, but they don't got uh, Hang me. And I hit a rapper, a big time rapper. Shh, man. man. I got to make sure I ain't made no mistakes. You got to make sure. Yeah, you don't tell nobody nothing. You can't brag on this. You can't brag on this. You remember now, you're going to get the same amount of time. Like if somebody got up out of here. And ain't nobody, everybody's still alive. Still going strong, some critical condition. You gotta look for you know, uh, Prince Montana, uh, bodyguard, he in critical condition. So, you got a few. So, there's way more people in stable condition. So, that's the blessing. Yeah, so, um, but it just flashed out. Like, bro, you gonna go that hard, you might well go where the money at. Like, you robbing him for a watch. You ain't gonna get no money for it. Like, what you think? Like, the street nigga, like, you gonna go buy some, some Zai, some soft. You probably get some dog food. You know what I'm saying? Or you gonna spend on some dumb shit like 
So yeah, it ain't enough. Like the wallet, you ain't gonna do nothing with that. Like you ain't no scammer. You ain't no big scammer. You a stepper. You a, you a jack boy. You ain't no scammer. You may know somebody though. You know what I'm saying? You may know somebody. Um, it is Miami, but these people they hit up. They ain't just raw. They hit up. So the police they own that. So you sure you want to do that? Like you ain't really got no stacks and nothing. No couple hundred dollars maybe. Maybe. Come on, man. Well, he could have, you know, he could have been a street nigga, so you never know. He could have had a stack and hundreds folded up in there. You know what I'm saying? On the side, damn, man. 4 9, man, got caught up in this shit, man. Could have lost his life. Could have lost his legs. Could have lost, yeah, his arm. Could have lost it. Yeah. Could have got hit in the face. All because, you know what I'm saying? So now you gotta, you know, it's kind of hard to stop something like this because unless everybody gets searched, but well, anybody can shoot up to the um, video shoot. You, if you're doing it in the hood and outside where people can walk up and or well, they just on the side. You could have had security that was blocking where y'all was at. You know what I'm saying? But shit, that's just that part right there. They right there though. They just can't come over there where y'all at. But they right there. A nigga put out that fire and get the spring. And you got hit because you right there. You know what I'm saying? A couple of feet. So we don't really make no difference. You getting y'all some, you know, that COVID space. Give me six feet, give me nine feet, whatever. Seven feet, five feet, four feet, whatever, two feet. Yeah, just y'all over there, we over here. We doing this right here. And security, they just your partners. You know what I'm saying? It probably ain't no real. They got the chopper with the vest with the ski mask and they ain't like, nah. Situation like this ain't raw fault. He was just at the right place at the wrong time. You know, nigga seen a lick. Yeah, he got up on that. He got that. And he was going to kill for that. He was going to do whatever he had to do to get that. So, yeah. He got to live with 10 people hit. He got to live with 10 people hit. And he going to hope he get away. But he know if he get caught up. You know what I'm saying? He gone. He gone. So, his run over with. So, you better make sure. You want the bragging rights, you going down. You do something with that wallet, you going down. You do something with that wallet, you going down. Fingerprints, all that the, on those credit cards, you touch all them credit cards, you going down. Yeah, you go through the uh, wallet, you touch all the uh, credit cards, now your fingerprints on all that there. But you just put it back in there. Now I didn't even think about that. It ain't like it's no guns or anything. Cause you ain't gonna burn them, you gonna just throw it somewhere. You see what I'm saying? So they gonna find some fingerprints. Unless you just burn the whole wallet and you just tell me everything. They'll find something, I'm telling you, man. Cause you gonna touch it. And you ain't gonna wipe it down or nothing like that. Or do what you need to do. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So it be less stuff stuff like that. Um, if you keep it, like <laughs> if they run down on you. All they gotta do is get a name, man. Yeah, it is right there. You did it. <laughs> you got the wallet. You did it. You got the credit card. One card. You can have one card. One card in there. You did it. And you better get rid of that gun for the SWAT team come. Yeah. The switch too. Don't be trying to take the switch off and put it on the other gun. Now you can't get caught with no guns with no switches on. I'm telling you. So, um, you gonna, I know what you're gonna do. You're gonna brag on it. You're gonna tell the wrong person, a female or somebody, and it's 10 people, so that means 10 different families. So you better be careful. That's 10 different families, not including their friends. They all got friends, and they got friends. All right, now, you can't brag on this. I know you like, you sitting in the crib now, like, damn, this was a fool. 10 months. You don't wanna get caught for it, but you're like, damn, I want food. You know what I'm saying? You really kinda of patting yourself on the back. Like, damn, I hit Tim in 10 seconds. And it's going to pump your head up, man. You're going to feel like that guy. You might, yeah, do it again. Now, I ain't going to say 10, but still be sticking. Still be sticking. You understand? And it might, it might not make you get rid of the switch. Yeah, you get rid of the fire, but you keep the switch. Because you like how that, yeah. You like the reaction, so you get caught up by the action. So, understand, like, um, 
Let us know what you're doing. Yeah, man, Ron for nine, man, he expecting a recovery and uh, all 10 of the victims, nine of the victims, including him, they all gonna bounce back. That's what we're gonna pray for. They all bounce back. And if they want justice, then yeah, they get justice. Let them get that street, you know, a court system. They, you know, they probably won't court. But Rob Street, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, because Rob, them bullets could have been meant for you and your whole crew. Yeah, take all them shells. Witness it don't matter. Yeah, because y'all, you know what y'all did to that boy? That Rob, that man. And they got that drop. <laughs> Everybody thinking you the victim. But you, you was the aggressor. Y'all did that shit first. Because you know them New Orleans niggas, they rob something, they take something. Yeah, you know they good for that. They known for that. So, hmm. It might not just be what everybody thinking. It could have been your niggas that did them something and they came back. Because you shooting a video and y'all dropping stuff on Instagram and Facebook and all that stuff. And they retaliated. Or, is what I was saying in the video. Like, there's somebody in the crowd. You ain't had nothing to do with it. That bullet wasn't meant for you. Like, nah. You just got caught up in the crossfire. That or somebody was trying to rob somebody in your squad. That's it. Like, ain't nothing else. It's one of them. So, y'all drop in the comments, man. Y'all tell me, man. What y'all feel, man? Like, yeah, if I'm wrong now, y'all let it be known. Y'all cuss me out in the comments, but it's one of them three, A, B, C. You see what I'm saying? So, that's what it is, man. Go!